Hi everybody, welcome to the channel. My name is Scott and today we're here at SEMA in Las Vegas. And today I'm going to be showing you a little bit. I've just got done filming a live video that I just posted a second ago, but the cell service here is just not the greatest. So I got a little bit a little bit down the way there and started to, uh, the video started to cut out. So you guys may have seen part of this, um, but I'm gonna, hopefully this will be a lot better video for you. So um, I'm just gonna turn the camera around and show you what we've got. Uh, these here are the Optima series uh, uh, street cars. And uh, Optima sponsors these guys uh, every year. Um, they're, they do various things. Um, you know, they've got trucks involved in it. Um, there's Camaros, there's Mustangs, uh, you know, all different ages. Um, so I'm just gonna walk this and show them off to you. I mean, there's there's Corvettes of all different years. Uh, there's some more exotic ones that are up here a little ways down. Um, so like I said, we're just gonna go ahead and uh, just gonna walk them and show off, show them off to you. Um, I was here last year and I did this. Um, I showed showed the cars off, and then uh, at the end of the uh, on Friday at the end of the show, uh, these all. Uh, these all go out uh, on a parade and they go out to the SEMA Ignited show uh, where you can go look at them there too. But you actually be able to see them, uh, see them run and actually go. Um, so you can see here we've got the uh, SEMA, SEMA sticker there on the wall. Um, but yeah, Optima seems to, uh, they've got a, a booth inside. They've got a couple of them out here. Um, so they are really big supporters uh, of making sure this thank you um, so, um, so you can see they're, they're supporting these cars it's really cool we've got a couple a um, couple of cars here from what I understand hopefully our sponsor or one of not uh, our my my Corvette clubs, uh, just for Corvettes out of Sacramento. Um, we have a Chevy dealership, Able Chevrolet, that uh, helps sponsor some of our car shows, um, and uh, they are big into Corvette. Um, so they are. Um, I think they have a couple of cars here today. We're walking by, but they're really. So I'm going to come right over here like to this, up to this truck here, and then I'm going to swing back around and look at these exotics over here, and then we'll, then I'll continue going down the way. Um, so you can see so we've got a McLaren here. Um, it's real, real funny how these guys are. They, they know everyone's got all these cameras, but thank you guys. Now that is a deep hole in a C5, I'll tell you what. And there's a C7. And then you got the, the Super Metro bus. That thing's got a scream, right? Alright. So you can see one of the Optima trailers right there. Um, so we're going to swing back around and uh, see if we can get you some more views here. This is uh, We're going through a kind of a, a roadway here between the convention center and, um, and the Westgate. Um, you can see right there, it's the Westgate Casino. This used to be the Las Vegas... Las Vegas um, Hilton and uh, that changed a few years ago but uh, it's a good looking Camaro right there and then uh, I tell you I don't know um, Chevrolet stepped up their game this year as far as being able to have some you know with the C8 they've got three C8s here as you've seen on the vid on the on the show um, already I posted them yesterday I've um, been posting on Facebook and stuff like that um, let you guys see what's going on but 
you know, I gotta say, I gotta hand it to, to Ford. They have really, you know, last year especially and this year too. I mean, they're just, they're just going crazy. Um, the amount of cars that they have brought and merchandise for purchase and stuff like that. I am just, I'm really, really surprised that Chevrolet is allowing that to happen. That they're just kind of getting left in the dust. Um, I wish that wasn't the case. I wish that, you know, that they, uh, thank you guys. You know, I wish they would actually, uh, you know, be more active in this. Um, but they, they didn't bring a Camaro this year. Um, I am understanding that, that you too. Um, but they didn't bring a Camaro. I'm understanding that they're not gonna continue the Camaro again. Which is kind of sad. Um, see, there's another trailer there for, for Optima with some more cars. There's a good looking vet. And guys, some of the stuff you may have just seen, uh, you know, I'll be getting this video up here hopefully in the next, you know, uh, few days, maybe next week, um, depending on how much time I have uh, in the next few days. Um, when I, or actually when I get back, so it probably will be next week. Some of the stuff you might have just seen, I got right up to about right, about right here, maybe it's a little bit farther up with my live video and the video, the cell service just cuts off right here. And it's like, as soon as I got right to this, this wall, it just stopped. So, um, so I said, well, okay, better break out the GoPro and get some good footage. So then that way you guys can actually see this. So this, this might be kind of double, um, this, double foot you know footage here no. Never ceases to amaze me. And they see you coming with a camera and they just stop. <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> no. Yeah. All right. I'm not exactly sure what that one's doing, but there we go. Here's another one. Hey guys, I don't know if uh, you know, as you well know, ACS uh, sponsors the channel. And um, one of the things that I've been thinking about doing to my car is this uh, is this grill. Uh, take a look at this. It is a really cool grill. It's got LEDs in it. I don't know if you can see that. You can see, but uh, they they have this grill, and it's a really good looking grill. And it looks really cool when it's when it's lit up. Now this is very interesting. I don't think I've ever seen this done before. This is a stage two splitter with a stage three attached onto it. Tell me what you think about that. I'm, uh, I'm kind of, uh, I don't know. Yep. But you can see what I'm talking about there. It's, it's uh, I do like the grill, but I don't know if I like that. Anyway, yeah, let me know what you think about that one. I don't think I would be doing that with mine, but... Um, other than that, I think it's a good-looking car. Yeah. And that just got my attention there for a minute. All right, well, let's get, let's get back down the, down the way here. And then here's a, another Camaro. All right, here we go, race chick. Now this is one of Abel Chevrolet's, that's it. Yep. So Abel Chevrolet is, this is, uh, this is one of their cars right there. Beautiful. This is the R1. And then we've got another Camaro.
Mustang. And then we've got another another C6 here. This is pretty cool. I mean, look at the the graphics right on the top there. Very cool. The lights got carbon fiber in them. We're talk about some splitters going on. Look at that. Kind of crazy. Keeping that roof. That thing on the ground, that's for sure. Alright. I recognize a lot of these from last year. They're good, but they are good looking cars, that's for sure. So guys, I'm run to the end here. So I'll just give you a kind of a clue of what it looks like. Like I said, this is just normally just a little access road just in between the two buildings. But anyway, there's John and Terry. Uh, <laughs> so, guys, thank you for watching. I appreciate it. And you guys have a good one. I'll talk to you later. Thank you for watching the Corvette channel. Don't forget to hit subscribe.